Brought to you by My Eleven Circle. Win first prize one crore every day. Download the app now. Simon, my last question. A word on Andrew Simon's. Uh, we lost a great soul a few days back, mm. and within a span of three months, we lost three legendary Australian players: Sir Rodney Marsh, uh, Shane Warne, and uh, then Andrew. Uh, I'm getting goosebumps. Uh, mm. uh, your words on it? Yeah. Look. Uh... It's obviously been a very sad time and, and uh, you know, the, the families and the teammates and the, the friends involved in all of this really do um, do feel sorry and, and we're just obviously heartbroken uh, for all of their sakes. Uh, um, and the game of cricket has lost some absolute legends um, and, and good people. And I think it reminds us, when you look at the ages of some of those people, you know, Shane at 51, 52, uh, Roy at uh, 46, and Rod Marsh, the same age as my mother, uh, when when she passed away, it's far too young, and, and we we feel that enormous sense of loss and and being deprived of you know their ongoing knowledge being put back into the game. Uh, that's what we're sorry about. We're sorry for their families, particularly to not be able to to have their their dad, their brother, uh, family member with them anymore. Uh, what do we take away from that? Well, we take away that life is short, and that's what I learned in 2009 in Lahore. Uh, we learned that we've got to make every day count um, and tell the people that we do love that how special they are and how important they are in our lives and to, yeah, just, just make every moment count because it's, it's so precious. Any uh, particular memory, fond memory that you have of Andrew? Yeah, look, Andrew was a bit of an enigma. Um, he did some amazing things on and off the field and probably did some regretful things off the field as well. Uh, I was only uh, reminiscing with um, Steve Bernard here at Fairbreak uh, last week uh, before he died, actually, funny enough. But, uh, you know, Andrew um, was unfortunately asked to go home from a couple of tours when Steve Bernard was Australian team manager. But, but back to your question, you know, Roy gave me probably one of the funniest moments on the field that I was umpiring when I did a, an India and Australia game one day in, in, in Brisbane at the Gabba when a streaker ran on the field and I, I turned around and wondered what all the commotion was and I saw this naked man running towards me and the stumps and, and Andrew at the non-striker's end. And Andrew decided to lay the shoulder into this guy to basically say, you're not welcome here um, <laughs> and I'm going to give you some pain for your trouble and uh, just knocked him flat on his back. And, you know, that, the sound of that big hit, uh, sticks with me today and probably one of the funniest things. And I remember walking up to Simo after that and I said, mate, um, perhaps you shouldn't be doing that. That's probably not a good idea. And um, but, but thank you very much. I love seeing it. It was really good. Yeah, so a bit of a, you know, a balance, you know, something really funny, but something not so good. मेरे साथ जुड़िए मनाने के लिए क्रिकेट का सबसे बड़ा त्योहार मैच से जुड़े आपके हर सवाल का हम देंगे जवाब जानने के लिए हर अपडेट लाइव एनालिसिस स्पेशल इंटरव्यूज डाउनलोड कीजिए स्पोर्ट्स द कैम्प